Well, hello, no excuses, scholars. It's a thankful Thursday, September 19th, 2024. We're making the ascent to become a high grow world class elementary school. And we're taking a look at the word respect. It's showing honor, giving worth or value to another person. Have you shown respect to someone else? And I like what Mr. H said, it actually fits in with our pack mentality. Even though it's not one of the words, respect goes all through our pack mentality. And of course, it's a great time to be a Husky. It's time for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand, place your right hand over your heart. Ready to begin? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Well, hey, this uh, coming up very soon, September 30th and October 1st and 2nd, we're going to have our next PAC Awards. And again, we're looking at perseverance, the P in PAC mentality. So hopefully you're going to be one who gets the Perseverance Award, the PAC Awards. So that's September 30th, October 1st and 2nd. Ask your teacher when. Well, we're continuing to celebrate National Hispanic Heritage Month. We have a special one today. We have, well, his name is Richard Anthony Cheech. That's what everybody calls him, Cheech Marin. He was born in 1946. He's an American comedian. He's an actor, musician, and activist. He gained a lot of popularity in the 1970s and 1980s with a group called Cheech and Chong. He's been voices and characters in Disney films like Oliver and Company, The Lion King, The Lion King One and a Half, The Cars, all the Cars movies, Coco, and Beverly Hills Chihuahua. And see this picture of this building. He is in charge of what is called the Cheech, which is a museum here in Riverside, not too far away from High Grove. I've been there and I highly recommend that everybody go to it. It is really neat and it has a lot of uh, Hispanic um, artwork and different artifacts. So worth going. So he is a part of Riverside's history now himself. So thank you, Cheech Marin. All right. Well, get this. Last weekend, I had a chance to go see... Um, Justin Hudson, remember the guy who came and talked to us, his I heart, I love IE. And he has a brand new store in Redlands, California. And I got a good chance to see his new store. And you see my picture over the right hand corner there. They had balloons, they had music, they had food, a lot of fun. And so, and I got to see Justin, it was really good to see him again. And I picked up some items from his store. And these are the people who get to come pick one. So I have only four items. So Olivia and Mrs. Denman's class, Kaylee and Miss Guerrero's class, Daniela and Miss Venegas class, and Jameson and Mr. Franz's class. So when your teachers say it's okay, come on to the office. Hopefully I'm there and you get to pick one of these items in my office. So thank you, Justin Hudson. Great store, great products. And congratulations to all of you who I picked the names from the Paw Pack. So if you got a Paw Pack award, um, a little slip, then that's how I got your name. So good job, you four. All right, Avid, are you using your Avid strategies? One Avid strategy is organization. Keeping yourself organized by writing your assignments down in your planner. It is important to keep track of all your assignments for school and home events. That is a great strategy. Well, we have the movie night coming up. Friday, October 11th starts at 6 p.m. If you want to be here, it'll be a lot of fun. So that's movie night. Well, we missed uh, last week when we talked about colleges. So I've got two for you real quick this week. We have uh, University of Nevada, Reno from Mr. Curtis's class. He represents it. And just look at the neat buildings that are there. And if you can see, there's some even, even snows there once in a while. So it's not, you know, it's a, it's a state away, a couple states away, but it's, it's really neat. So much cool architecture. I love this one room in the middle there. And so well done, Mr. Curtis and your class, the University of Nevada, Reno. Good choice. And 
Today, we're looking at Louisiana State University, or LSU, and this is represented by Mrs. DeSavio's class, another fantastic university. Now, this one is a little far away. It's in Louisiana. You can look it up on a map, and they are the home of the Tigers. But wow, they are really good in sports. They've got some really neat programs and, of course, a, a neat campus as well. This is one you might want to look at as well. So thank you, Mrs. DeSavio. Great choice of universities. All right, for lunch today, looks like we're having some orange chicken, brown rice, coleslaw, and pineapples. Yum, yum, yum. Well, here's our joke of the day. I got this from Mikey in Mr. Franz's class. What do you call a fake noodle? Hmm. What do you call a fake noodle? Any ideas, any guesses? Let's find out. Well, uh, in pasta. An in pasta. All right, thanks, Mikey, for sending it to me. And everyone else, please send me jokes. I need more. And of course, scholars, education is for improving the lives of others and for leaving your community, the Riverside High Grove community, and you're the whole world better than when you found it. All right. Huskies, we're going to be high-growth world class. Have a very thankful Thursday. <laughs>